Now, this is how we can add a stop on your Waze navigation on the iPhone and let's get started. So just like usual, you can open up the Waze app and have the navigation ready. Like you type in the destination, then of course hit a start and you can begin with the navigation process. But as you are in here and see your location on a map or whatever it is, you can swipe up on it like that. And it gives you the ability to check out some uh, like um, best time to leave and like the estimated time of arrival and like some information about the route. But if you swipe up a bit more, you have a little section with the title add a stop. And at first you have three options like you can directly search for stops for parking, gas stations or charging most likely and also the restaurants right so these are most common stops on the way right so you can click on something like that and it's going to give you some food stops along the way so that's actually really useful but you can also use the search button right next to the stop section there which gives you the ability to search for literally anything on the map which you might add as a stop right it might be a city it might be a shop or I don't know, like a food place, parking, grocery store, whatever it might be, you can search for it on the map, part of the stop section, and it will give you the ability to incorporate it into the route of your trip. So that is how it works. Most definitely let me know below if you have any additional questions about it. Subscribe for tutorials like this one in the future, and I'm going to catch you later. So stay tuned and I'll see you then.